sustained with the industrial action and backed on by members of the Academic Staff Union of Universities, the Federal University of Technology of Korea has joined the ongoing warning strike. But parents and students aren't comfortable with the one-month strike, blaming the federal government for failing to honor the agreement reached with ASU. Ayodej Maradio reports. After ASU's Congress at the Federal University of Technology of Korea, FUTA, the chairman of the branch announced the decision of the union to join the ongoing warning strike. The industrial action is coming after universities in Nigeria were shut down for close to one year, not too long ago, as a result of a lingering dispute between the federal government and university teachers. The lecturers blamed the federal government for failing to honor the agreement it reached with the union 11 months ago, which ended the previous strike. So from today, in Futa, the strike has fully commenced. It is not a warning strike, as some people are calling it. The same demand before we went on the last one in 2020, that the federal government should renegotiate our 2009 agreement, sign it and implement it, that the federal government should ensure that the university autonomy does not fall, that the university should be revitalized. The one-month strike has begun to take its toll on academic and social activities in the university. The students who are always at the receiving end are not pleased with the strike. Normally, we haven't had strike um, for nine months or so last year, the last two years, and it affected us, the scheme, and um, how to meet up. Because normally, most of us are even old. Every student is going to be affected due to the fact that even uh, the corona as of uh, 2020 had to you know, uh, make things slow for us and then this issue of strike. So the thing is that it's affecting us. Parents are also disturbed about this trend, which they say is not good for the country's education system. It's embarrassing to parents. Most importantly, if you look at the way things is going in the in the, uh, in the educational system of Nigeria, you will see that they were trying, probably government is trying to bastardize the life of these children. The backlog of the graduate in the university today. And still, instead of them to graduate them, they are said they are going on strike. You remember what happened last year? How many months do we stay, the, the students of the university stay at home? The students are appealing to the federal government to meet the demands of the striking lecturers so that they can complete their education. On time, Ayodeji Moradeo, TVC News, Akure.